Hey guys, it's Joanne here, and guess what I got for you today? I got some empties to go through with you. So you ready? Stay tuned. I know it's been a little while since I've done an empties video, but I have. I wanted to get these out of the way so I can throw the stuff out. And so let's just get right to it, shall we? My first empty is, is the vanilla brown sugar scented. I think this is the April and oh my God, I love this stuff, guys. I have bought this. This is Greenbrier International. It doesn't say the April body whatever, but it's just it looks like this and it's good. I, this is a staple for me. I buy these a lot. Yes, I do. I do. So this is another uh, em This is another empty. This is my favorite shampoo and they're hard to find so when I do find them I actually do purchase a lot of them and this is the Sammy uh, Juge <laughs> uh, Fun Fiber Shampoo. It smells really good and it's very it's very thick, it, uh, and, and I love the combination of this with the conditioner, but I do make sure I stock up on the shampoo because I do use the shampoo uh, in a greater, higher proportion than the um, conditioner. These are some duplicates. Why do, I don't know why I have to keep on. Uh, I'll just show you guys. I'm still using these. I'm still using the Sensitive, the Sensitive Extreme. Uh, whitening fluoride toothpaste. I really like this. I've never had any issues with these, this toothpaste. Uh, I have, I, honestly, I have very, very sensitive teeth when it comes to cold. And since I've been using this, I have no issues whatsoever with, uh, with sensitivity. So yeah, I highly recommend this product. I've been using it, like I said, for probably almost a year. You guys probably see, see these all the time, me purchasing them. And I just thought I'd show you, here's two of them in my garbage. <laughs> Another thing that I use a lot, see, it's been a while since I've done empties, but I have two of the Teen Spirit. I love the smell of these. I guess it makes me feel like I'm a teenager again. I don't know, but uh, I love the smell of this. It works really well. This is antiperspirant and deodorant. And again, it is the uh, Lady Speed Stick. It's by Lady Speed Stick, but it's called the Teen Spirit. The other thing I have that I bought in the fall, and I bought a bunch of them, and I'm so glad I did, is this Soft Soap Cozy Autumn Day. And I have to tell you guys, this is... This has got to be by far my favorite hand soap that I have gotten from the Dollar Tree. I absolutely love the smell of this all year long, not just cozy autumn day. I have still have three more of these, I think, and I know they were only seasonal, but I may actually try to find like a refill or something on Amazon because I absolutely love, love, love this scent. Uh, this is like the only scent that I want in my house now. <laughs> Love it. Talking about the uh, this, I wanted to make sure I talked about this, guys. Uh, I absolutely love these Fabric Softener Refreshener. They're, um, says, with floral scent enhancers and scent boosters. This smells very, very clean, very, very fresh. I love these, guys. Uh, I've been buying these scents. I first saw them, I think probably, gosh, it's been a couple of months now that I've been using this, 10 ounces. But what I want you to watch out for is when you go to buy these, the, what I want you to do before you actually throw them in your um, cart, I want you to open them up and I want you to look at them. There is a bunch of these that are made that are like, they're almost like the leftovers, the rejects, and they're very flat, or the, either that or they got melted in shipment and they kind of got really flat and melted and I don't necessarily know are if those are of the best quality or not so just make sure you open these up and take a look at them and make sure they're um, they're little balls because that's what they should be <laughs> not little flattened things so yeah these and this is a uh, is this a Greenbrier product it's HE compatible which a lot of people ask about that 
so it is um, the high efficiency. It's made, um, it's distributed by Closeouts and more out of New York, New York. So two fails, these are all really good things. Two fails I wanted to talk to you guys about is the one I mentioned, uh, you guys have seen my videos, my, my prior two videos, I will leave a link here for them so you can check them out. But it has to do with the Sally Hansen Salon Effects nail polish strips. You wanna be very careful with those and don't go buy a ton of, don't go buying a ton of them when you see them at the Dollar Tree. They are actually hit or miss at the Dollar Tree. They do have, um, they, they will expire over time. Those nail strips will become brittle and will not no longer be usable. And there's really not much you can do to try to save them. And the only way you're gonna know, know if yours are bad is if you actually go and try to use them. <laughs> so if you start peeling off the stuff and you see it's really stiff, and there's no sticky, the thing is dried up, you might as well forget about it. What I have learned is that I have learned from a lot of people that have made comments in my comment section, and I really appreciate you guys leaving these comments because people need to know this information. You actually can return stuff to the Dollar Tree. So if there's stuff that you don't like, as long as you have a receipt, you can get store credit and be able to buy something else. So keep that in mind when you're finding these things and you're not very happy with the quality of them. Make sure you do the, take that opportunity to bring them back to the store and get yourself store credit. So the the other thing that was bad that I will I will insert a picture of, we'll just talk about it briefly, it is the shower curtain liners, the really thin liner things. Those are horrible. I don't know why I keep on buying them, but they don't have any weights at the bottom, so they just kind of like float up in your shower. I've tr I tried clipping binder clips to the bottom of mine to, to just until I'm ready to use, ready to not use it anymore. But it literally, they, they just, they're very thin. They're, they're not, they're not even worth a dollar and it, they're not even worth me trying to attempt to fold it back up to bring it back to the store. So just be forewarned that those shower curtains are very, very thin and I don't just, I don't like them. The other thing that I did not like, and this, these were a big, big item last summer that everybody was hauling and everybody was buying. And I would love to know everybody's comments on them because I just can't get these to work. And that's these really cute, because they're, they're starting to come back out now. They are these really cute like headband type things that have like elastic down here. And then they kind of spread off the top. Guys, these, these just like did not hit my head very well. And like this part would like, kind of like stick up and it wouldn't stay and it kept on sliding and I, I just I ended up getting more frustrated with these than anything so unfortunately these were a fail for me and I will not be buying any more of them I'm trying to figure out what I can do with this with this type of fabric and I have a I have an idea of what to do with it so yeah so if I come up with a DIY for this outside of using this I don't want to I like to try to repurpose things. Yeah, I'll let you know if I come up with something for this. But if you have any ideas of how I could repurpose this, let me know in the comments below. Okay? Thank you. So that is it for me today, guys. I know it was a small little... I just wanted to get rid of these. I was going through, starting to clean up my lady cave a little bit, and I just wanted to go through and get rid of all these things that are, like, seriously, they're garbage. Like, my husband's like, why are you hanging on to these? I'm like, because I have to do a video to show YouTube all the stuff that I actually like. That is it for me today, guys. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Hi, I'm Joanne. Nice to meet you. Why don't you hit the subscribe button and then you'll be notified of when I upload new videos. And if you'd like to hang out with me on my other social media profiles, I am at Joanne Plans on Instagram, Periscope, uh, Twitter, and Snapchat. So that's it for me today, guys. You guys be awesome. Enjoy the rest of your day. And guess what? I'm going to chat with you in my next video. Bye, guys.